We all know that we're living in a world where the rate of change is accelerating exponentially, and so is the extent and degree of interconnection, and they're each feeding one another. The demand for repetitive activity is going down. Those are just facts, but they explain a lot of what's going on. This is really important for any organization to understand this is the new strategic environment. And one of the consequences of that environment is that any organization that doesn't help all its people be change makers is going to do very badly, very quickly in this world. Let me explain a little bit more fully. Here's a fact question. Why is it that the income inequality is getting worse everywhere in the world? Second fact question. Why is it that in the last five or six years, there has been a growing wave of us versus them politics sweeping across the globe? That's also a fact. Now, both of them are global. They're not explained by local economics or politics. So what's going on here is that a large part of the world, the successful part, is already living in the everyone a change maker world. This is the new reality. It's a fluid, open, integrated team of teams architecture. People are in many teams. They're changing really fast. And that world requires everyone to have a very different set of skills. The old model of give people a skill, banker, barber, doesn't matter. They repeat it for life in a world with a lot of walls. That was fine when there was very little change. It doesn't work anymore. That world is dying. You can't afford to be in that world any longer. You and your people and anyone who's important to you really has to get into the new game. How can you possibly do that if you don't help your people make that transition? And it's a big transition.